Ramesses the Second Rise to Power Ramesses the Second was born into royalty and spent his youth being educated and prepared to be the leader of Egypt. He had an older brother who was first in line to become the pharaoh after his father. But when Ramesses was 14, his older brother died. A while after, when Ramesses was 25, his father died, leaving him to rise to power. He reigned for 66 years from 1279 to 1213 BC. Leadership Style Ramesses II is also known as Ramesses the Great for the way he displayed his power during his reign. He held strong le leadership in military roles and aimed to build strength by expanding the kingdom and conquering nearby territories if they threatened him. If he felt it was right, he would make a treaty, a formal agreement of peace, with another kingdom. He felt that war was necessary at times to keep the peace for his people of Egypt. Accomplishments Ramesses had a interest in architecture, which led him to build more buildings than any other pharaoh. He built monuments, temples, and memorials, some dedicated to him, of course, that are still standing today. Many of the buildings built reflect his value of the military, politics, and religion. By building a strong military, Ramesses the Great established strong borders and prevented many invasions from serious threats from foreign nations. It is thought that Egypt would not have been able to withstand those threats if it were not for Ramesses II's leadership. Did you know? Historians believe that he had around 200 children during his life. Ramesses II established the first international treaty known to historians. He once led a battle that included an army of 5,000 chariots.